a cat came to me and asked me, how do I get the bass and drums to come out of this machine over to the rest of my instruments, right? So today, I'm going to walk you through exactly how I go about doing it. And I'm just going to use this uh, Boss Dr. 202 today. First of all, all right, so, so this show on the road with how do you go about getting the bass and drum parts to get out of the uh, Dr. Boss drum machine. I'm going to break this down to you all the way. First of all, find your MIDI out. This is your MIDI out here, and this is a MIDI in. I use MIDI in and MIDI out, and you got your foot switch here, all right? So I'm going to go ahead and hook up my MIDI output right now. Come on, come on. All right. So now, the MIDI output's in. And of course, I got to have some sound come out of this rascal. So, plug that in like that. Turn this rascal around like so. And I'm getting ready to show you the insides like I see of how when to work it. comes it. down to um, having the bass come out, then of course you got to go to you need to go to your MIDI. First thing it says MIDI channel drum ten. That's what I have it on. Move the cursor over. MIDI channel equals bass two. You can have this bass go all the way up to channels one through channel sixteen. Uh, MIDI channel external 10 uh, MIDI program change switch to off I have it at off MIDI volume off drums at 127 bass at 120 external 127 MIDI expression MIDI control change MIDI through on make sure that MIDI through is on and this is the main part right here it says MIDI out assigned drums internal and drums external meaning that you can have the drums go out so you can actually have the drums go to another drum machine like um, let me see if I can change it up. All right. Anyways, then go to the next. It says bass internal and bass external. Make sure that bass uh, is set for internal and external because we're going to send that out. Uh, turn that MIDI sync off. Keep it internal. Let's go ahead and try something out. Okay, so that's, y'all hear that? Now, I'm going to add the rest of the instruments in to let you know what I'm talking about. See that? When you hit, when you hit um, one key, it should make all the other instruments do the same thing. But you need to make sure that it is in proper in the proper MIDI channel, you know what I'm saying, to make sure that it receives right. Let me show you what I'm talking about. Watch this. All right. Now that's not coming from the boss. That's coming from another keyboard. Now, this is how I do it. All right, y'all. So I just had to put this out for a little bit. You know what I mean? 